how to find tax sale overages. By the end of this video, you'll know how to find tax sale overages all across the country with simple Google searches. Did you know you can find tax sale overages online in minutes? In today's video, I'm gonna show you how. Watch as I dive into real world examples showing you me doing actual searches and finding those overages in just minutes. Overages actually go by different names in different states. In today's videos, you're gonna learn those different names so that you can successfully find them in all the different states. Overages are very easy to find online. Just simply put in the search XYZ County State Overages or XYZ County State Excess Funds. Google's smart enough to know if you use the wrong term. For example, if you put in the search DeKalb County, Georgia Excess Funds, you'll get right to the website where the list is. Now be aware, when you go on the website, you may have to poke around a little bit, just look around to see where it has a link to excess funds or overbids or overages. You'll see all of those terms and just click on it. And typically there's a, either a PDF document or an Excel spreadsheet where it lists all the monies that they're holding and that's the overages money. You can see a couple examples on your screen of me finding excess funds in Florida, in Georgia, in Connecticut. You can do it all over the country, and that's an example of how easy it is to find these tax sale overages. Now, these lists are typically held by the tax collector, the county treasurer, or the sheriff, or in a few states, they eventually make it up to the state level. It's easy to figure out, though, because through the magic of Google, they're smart enough to direct you to the right website. And the lists are generally very easy to read. You'll see a reference to the tax sale. It might say the June 2024 tax sale. You'll generally see the address of the property, the name of the person that's entitled to claim the funds. That's going to be the former owner, the amount of money that they're holding and when they got the money in. So all that information is there and that makes your job really easy. Once you find the list of overages, you're just gonna do a couple simple things after that. You're gonna get the contact information for the former owner, person that's shown on the list. You're gonna reach out to them and give them the good news that there's some money that they could claim and see if they wanna work with you for a percentage. And then if they say yes, you're gonna sign them up using some simple paperwork. You're gonna turn in that claim, get that money and split it between you and them. Really very simple, straightforward business and because as you can see on these lists, there are huge amounts of money being held, and typically you're taking a percentage of that. For us, that's generally 30 to 40%. It's a free country, you set your rates at what you want. But can you imagine, look at the lists that you see, you see claims for 10,000, 20,000, 50,000, 100,000, and more. Imagine that every time you do one of those deals, you're getting even 30% of that. 30% of a $50,000 deal, that's $15,000 cash in pocket. And quite honestly, it's probably 10 hours worth of work. Doesn't cost much to do. It's really the cost of mailing in the claim and hiring a notary to go out there and get the paper signed for you. It's a really low cost business where you're helping people, you're helping them get money they otherwise would never get, and you're making a fortune yourself. Really terrific business. Now there are two ways that these monies are claimed. One is a judicial process, the other is an administrative process. That varies by state. And if you get involved with our training and education, I tell you which states are which. Let me tell you about what the processes are for right now. Judicial process means the money is held in court. You have a lawyer go in, apply with something called a petition, and request the money. Typically takes three, four, five months, depending on the court system, and you get a check. Not particularly difficult, especially since the lawyer is doing most of the work and not that expensive. We usually budget $2,500 for that work and it's plenty. The second and thankfully more popular way to do it is the administrative claim. Administrative claim, you just fill in a form, hand it into the agency that's holding the monies, and they a couple months later will produce a check for you. Very straightforward, doesn't really have any cost to it. There's no cost to apply or anything. You don't have to hire a lawyer, just fill in the form. Pretty straightforward. Thankfully, that's the majority of states and that's generally the process. So it's one of the things that makes this business so attractive. You can really do most of it yourself. You need the education and the know-how, but once you have that, it's not really a capital intensive business. It's really business where your success comes from doing the work. You, know, you get the list, you look up the contact information, you call the people, let them know about the, the opportunity to get some money, see if they're interested. If they are, sign them up and turn in the claim. Really cool business. As you can probably tell, I really love the overages business. It's very clean, just produces little piles of cash. I know even looking at the list exactly how much money I can make in any particular claim. And that's kind of unique in business. Also, my leads are free. Like I can just go and pull these lists anytime I want. And you know, internally for us, right now we're sitting on a little over 14,000 leads, over $348 million, and we can't even pursue 10% of that. I mean, it's just 
you know, it's crazy to even think about doing that much work, which is why there's such a big opportunity in this business, because every week there are thousands of properties sold at tax sale. And especially these days with house prices being so high, there are lots of overages being created every week. So it's a great opportunity for someone who wants to have a work from home business that you can do that's very low cost to operate that really responds just to the action of picking up the phone and calling people and telling them the good news and saying if they want your help. Really, really great business. Great for retired people. Great for people who want to leave the corporate rat race. Great for people who want to have a side business to ramp up and maybe increase their retirement savings or retire all their debt. Really, really terrific business for anyone in that situation. Um, also good business for just good hearted people. If you own a business where you truly help people who really need the help, overages is your ticket because you're getting people that have been flattened financially. They've lost their house. They're sad. They're just feeling terrible about themselves and you show up and next thing they know they've got tens of thousands of dollars or maybe even sometimes hundreds of thousands of dollars that they're getting that they never knew they could have gotten and that frankly without you they would have lost because when this money sits for too long the government seizes it and keeps it forever so we're providing a really really valuable service and of course we get compensated well for that because you're bringing so much to people. So to learn more about the overages opportunity with overages as a business, just click on the link. I did a short introduction to overages video. It's about 15 minutes. You can dive a little deeper into this business, see if it's for you. If you're a good hearted person that wants a highly profitable business that you could do from home, it might just be perfect for you. So I did a 15 minute video where you can learn more about that. And from there, you get the opportunity to attend a free class that I have where I really dive deep and you can see if this really resonates with you. I think it's a great business. I think if you want a business where you help people and you make great money and you can do it from home, I think it's a terrific business for you. So your next step, click on that video and I'll see you over there.